Hello YouTube, welcome back to a new showcase. Today we're going to be showcasing Zach Blakely in H2O Maker Magic with Realistic. Hello Realistic. Hi, H2O Maker Magic, the best game out there. Oh. <laughs> Anyways, so Zach is a merman, obviously, and he got 300 health and 1350 magic. He is um, a game pass with Robux. That is his morph. He looks absolutely stunning. I love that. Um, can we so, zoom in the abs, please? God, look, he made some abs for... I can't even see because of the, the keybinds. He made some abs and he's proud of it. Girl, move. Uh-uh. What do you mean the keybind? So, let's move on to his keybind. The first keybind that he has is F, which is a water herb, as you can see. It can move willingly where your mouse goes. Um, you can also, if you click, you can send it to the target and does them a little amount of damage. Next, you have a C, which is a push. You basically push the target away from you and it does them also a little amount of damage. Um, next, we have is wave. Also, I forgot to show you guys the trident. Um, this is Zach's trident made by Realistic himself. Um, it looks absolutely um, amazing, which it can be used all for uh, some keybinds. The next keybind we have is Y, which you have to collect the Titan and then click on Y to send a wave, which will does quite a lot of damage to your target. Also, while collecting the, the, the Titan, we have the next keybind is Z, which is a beam. <coughs> It sends lightning from the trident towards your target. Next we have VG, which is a trident shield. Obviously you need trident for it. It's a shield which will protect you from any attacks, but remote spells will work on you. You can walk with it and hit, like, touch me. Touch me and walk. Oh, yeah, that's what it does. Stay back, bitch! Anyways. <laughs> Next we have is B, which is a lightning summon. You basically summon a storm, which will summon a lightning and hit everyone on the map. Or everyone near you. Which one? Everyone in the map. Everyone in the map, basically. Okay. Next we have Easter Kinesis, which will hold the target. And once you click, you will push them away. Dealing them a small amount of damage. Next we have is your probably the one you're waiting for, which is the Turn the Tide. Um, turn the Tide is a spell that protects you from attacks such as Water Balls. And it kind of like sends the magic back to them. I will show you. Attack me. So what I did is that I used Turn the Tide. And if your aim is good... You will be able to send the water ball or the anything that I talk to you with back to them and hit them with it. One more time, let's see it. Okay. Ah, You're my aim is bad, but if you're the sick, does it? It will look so good. Cause like, Let me... so turn the tide can also be used against your keybind Y, which is the wave, as you can see. Turn it back at me, okay? Ah, <laughs> so realistic I, aim is bad she didn't hit me but if he was aiming at me the wave that is sent to her would be back at me and i get damaged instead so turn the tide is kind of, water ball please so it's kind of like cool let's attack realistic See, oh my God. <laughs> I attacked Realistic with a freezed water ball and I got attacked instead because like he did turn the time. Bit. <laughs> Moving on to the next keybind we have is Shatter, which is X, but you have to use your water ball, you freeze it with G, and then you can shatter it using X. It's basically a water herb keybind. 
Also, ease is also whatever er herb key binds just evaporate. You evaporate the water herbs. Either yours or someone else's. And next yeah, key binds. You can protect yourself like that too. Yeah. If someone throws, you can shatter it too. If someone throws a frozen water ball. You can shatter it before you get attacked, which is kind of cool. Next, we have his R, which is fire. Put the target on fire. If they jump in the water, it will be removed. If they're not near any water, they will start taking damage until, well, it's done. <laughs> Next key one, we have his V, which is cloaking. You go invisible, as you can see. Once you let go, you will go back to be invisible again. Next key one, we have is you, which is telekinetic combo. Which it does quite a lot of damage and it can be also very helpful. Next key band we have is N, which is a vision sharing. Um, as you guys know, Zach was be, was able to share visions with uh, Mimi and it also has it in this game. He can share visions with other mermaids slash mermen. And know exactly their location while doing so. So you can run but you can't hide. <laughs> <laughs> Last key bind that he has is boil, which basically you can boil uh, water herbs. Wait, attack me with the water herb. Wait, no, I can kill my team. Okay, no, no, don't attack me, don't attack me, hold on. Okay. okay, so I can boil others' water herbs as well, or I can just boil my water herb. As you can see. Anyways, that was Zach um, Blakely showcase and h 2 Make a Magic. The game is almost done. Um, Realistic here is the owner. Is the game almost done or not? Yes, you can join the server to see the progress. You can join the server, link is down in the description or the first comment to see the progress of the game. Um, also, why didn't I show you the, the tales is because the tale transformation is not finished yet. The scripter slash owner, Joseph, is still working on it. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, join my Discord server, link is down in the description, as well as my robust group, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye! Bye!